good morning students i am your english teacher today we are going to start with the first poem of class 9 the name of the poem is the road not taken by robert frost so have you heard of robert frost earlier so have you read any poem written by robert frost now robert frost was a very famous american poet so normally speaking english poets are divided into two one american poet or the english poet or the poet of england and here we we'll learn about a particular very famous uh, poet of america and he was uh, born in california in the year 1874 and died in the year 1963 he was a famous nature poet and in his poem what we find a particular area of america that is called new england is depicted or portrayed or painted in almost all the other poems of robert frost as he was a nature poet so he gives a plain very beautiful description of nature and here you will see that is a beautiful description of a traveler traveling through the forest when when the road fought or diverged or when the road took two different turns therefore here you will see before the start of the poem we will see about the poem and particularly will be will be seeing how the meaning of the, the poem how the meaning of the poem can be different or varied now see my dear children in almost all the, the poems you will see there are two types of meaning one is direct meaning that is called the literal meaning okay and another one is indirect meaning or is called connotation means what is the implied oblique indirect meaning and that may be the metaphorical meaning that may be the implied meaning so in the poem usually many poetic devices now you are in class 9 you'll come to know about many poetic devices and the simple poetic devices are simile metaphor personification all this uh, all this figure of speech or the poetic devices actually make uh, what they actually beautify the poem and make it more clear and vivid so in this uh, poem we will uh, see there are four stanzas how many stanzas four stanzas and here we will uh, see so the poet himself is the speaker and he is talking about his own experience as a traveler it is not the simple traveler you will see he actually doesn't tell about the simple travel in the midst of the forest so he is indirectly or in a implied manner in a metaphorical manner he wants to tell about the choice that a particular person make in his life now my dear children the choice or the selection in life is very very important after class 10 you'll be making choice whether you will have to go for science or arts commerce or any other stream professional stream so after 12 now you will you will do what so you will again again you will be you will be having a lot of options lot of roads lot of lot of choices in life therefore taking choice or making choice in life is a very crucial or very important therefore you will see now how this choice is important what is the experience of the, the poet and how he explained about his own experience of the choice in life all this will be explaining and therefore let us see the first stanza of the poem in the first stanza you will see 
two roads diverse in yellow wood and sorry i could not travel boat and be one traveler long astute and look down one as far as i could to where it bent in the undergrowth I took the other just a sphere and having perhaps the better claim because it was grassy and wanted to wear. Though as far that the passing deer had owned them really about the same and both that morning equally lay in leaves no stiff had trodden back. Oh, I kept the first for another day yet knowing how way leads on to the way I doubted if I should ever come back. I shall be telling this with a sigh. Somewhere ages and ages hence, two roads diverse near wood and I. I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference. Robert Frost. Now let us see. Uh, so we'll uh, see the, the explanation of the, the first danger. So uh, here we'll uh, see the, the poet Robert Frost. Who is a nature poet who is a very much famous so he is the narrator here he explains his own experience so he was traveling and while he was traveling then what happened two roads diverse in a yellow wood so what is the meaning of diverse here so the meaning of the word diverse here is means so diverse actually D E R divert means the verb is coming okay the verb is divert means the simple meaning is F O R K fork means uh, so that the writer was uh, going okay this suppose this is the road and in a particular point what exactly happened it was just like the tuning fork tuning fork a tool in the science and in this point what you find he was actually had to do make a choice as to which route he will have to take and therefore what he did so he was a, he was standing there he was a, not actually instantly took one particular route because it is a question of his life and death and therefore therefore what he did he was standing there for a long time and looked down one as far as I could so he was looking down he was looking down look down means what look down simple meaning is a P R O B E do you know the meaning prove means scrutinize okay S C R U C R U T N I Z E scrutinize means making examination making examination of the other road so he was uh, he was actually seeing the prospect he was seeing the, the opportunity what is it there in the, the particular road as far as he could he was uh, making thorough or complete inspection of the, the road and he was also just trying to see what are the prospect what are the facilities what are the benefit in that particular road and after that what happened to where it bent in the undergrowth now so he was he was observing the, this this particular road the, the first one the, the first route and now he was inspecting and after that what happened so on the, the road he, he what exactly happened so his vision was obstructed by what by by many of the, the many of the, the many of the, the trees by the side of the, the road and under the tree lot or lot of small trees or the bushes also obstructed or prevented prevented uh, his vision to see the road very clearly therefore therefore what happened so he was a traveler he, he came to that particular point and in this particular point you will see that the road actually diversed so he was uh, making scrutiny of the, the first road he could not uh, see the, the full uh, road so this is just like our life so we can uh, see only the part that we have traveled the part that is in future we cannot uh, see it is just like the dark road which is uh, which is covered by the undergrowth or the small trees or the bushes have you got it 
okay now <clears throat> let us uh, come to the next one next tangent then i took the, the other just a sphere and having perhaps the better claim because it was grassy and wanted wear though as for that the passing there had owned them really about the, the same owned them really about the, the same now let us see <clears throat> so now once again uh, let us see the, the, the road so this is the, the road this is the road you will uh, see so this is the road now that the first road he has uh, he has already inspected usne bahut acche dhang se pehle rasta ko bahut acche dhang se matlab dekha usme kya kya matlab opportunity hai kya kya facility hai har kuch matlab dekhne ke baad उनको लगा कि ये रोड उनके लिए इतना सही नहीं है तो उसी लिए मतलब क्या क्या सो ही एक्चुअली वेंट इन फेवर ऑफ द नेक्स्ट रोड थिंकिंग दैट द नेक्स्ट रोड विल बी बेटर वन नाउ सी सो व्हेन यू आर गोइंग टू डू चूज योर कैरियर देन यू विल सी दैट ओ ऑलमोस्ट ऑल द पीपल आर गोइंग फॉर डॉक्टर आई विल नॉट गो फॉर डॉक्टर so i wanted to be something else i want to be iit engineer or something like that that means that means something very special and therefore in the, the similar manner that the pot here also pot actually crossed the crossed the many okay much of the, the part of the, the road and after that he had to do, take uh, take the, the take another one he had to do, he had the, the choice and therefore he went in favor of the second one and he was thinking that then took to the other just as fear what is the meaning of fear what is the meaning of fear fear means good fear means not the white one here fear means white also but here it will not be white so it uh, means good means both the roads were good then took to the other i took to the other one and this was as good as the earlier one and i also thought that perhaps this is uh, having the better claim so he was uh, thinking that perhaps means he is not actually certain that the other road that he has chosen is having better claim to ye aap dekhiye क्लेम का मीनिंग क्या होगा वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द वर्ड क्लेम क्लेम मीन्स द फैसिलिटीज क्लेम मीन्स द बेनिफिट्स एफ ए फैसिलिटीज फैसिलिटीज क्लेम मीन्स द फैसिलिटीज और द एडवांटेजेस बेनिफिट्स दिस इज यूज एज नाउन दे आर फोर so he thought he took the, the second one and he took uh, this one because he thought that this is having lot of prospect lot of benefits facilities advantages over the other one that he did not go for though as for that the passing there had own them really about the, the same abhi dekhiye ye jo own hai so this word actually come from where w e a r where where ka matlab hai simple meaning hai kapda jo pehna wo wear hota hai either meaning alag hoga this a meaning here here it will be so means covering covering something so the grass is there on the, the ground and it is a covering the, the covering the, the ground means it is grassy means it is a full of full of the blessing of nature because grass is also part of nature therefore he thought that lot of people did not pass there or may travel there but after traveling for some time he found that oh my goodness 
ही वॉज अ वेरी मच डिसअपॉइंटेड क्योंकि वो जो रास्ता था इसमें और उसमें इतना ज़्यादा डिफरेंस नहीं था दोनों रास्ता लगभग सेम ही था और ये एक्सपीरियंस उनको तब हुआ जब वो सेकेंड रास्ता चुना चुनने के बाद वो रास्ता पे उन्होंने चल दिया ट्रेवल किया देर फोर आफ्टर मेकिंग द चॉइस नाउ विल सी द थर्ड स्टेंज एंड बोथ दैट मॉर्निंग इक्वल इन ले इन लिव नो स्टेफ हट ट्रोड इन ब्लैक Oh, I get the fast for another day. Yet knowing how well it's to way, I doubt it if I should ever come back. So, my dear children, you see here, what is the kind of the feeling? Feeling here that the action is almost over. The action of choosing the the road or selecting the the road is over. Now we will see the kind of the feeling. The the kind of the feeling of the the foot. Now. so he is uh, telling that so he, when when i see that the road i inspect the road i scrutinize that the road i see that the road then i see that there is a no sign there is a no sign that that somebody has a trodden trodden on this uh, road back means once you are to attacking taking a particular road that means there is no return from the that you cannot take uh, cannot actually change the direction okay change the direction and cannot uh, come to this uh, particular position okay cannot uh, come to this uh, particular position just to just to take another road and therefore now he say he say you will see oh i kept the first one for another day yet knowing how well let's on to way इधर कैसा फीलिंग आपको एक्सप्रेस हुआ वर्ड ऑफ फीलिंग दैट इज एक्सप्रेस हियर वट इज द काइंड ऑफ फीलिंग्स द फीलिंग्स इज दैट ऑफ द कैसे मतलब ओ ओ में कैसा फीलिंग है ओ ही इज नो मोर ओ आई हैव लॉस द पेन ओ आई एम अंडान ओके तो ये जो ओ होता है ओ का मीनिंग क्या होता है कि देर इज द सेंस ऑफ रिग्रेट There is a sense of regret, the sense of loss. Kus ho be atna, okay? Therefore, now the poet is very much a regretful. Usko bhot absurd hua ki I kept the first first road to be taken in future, even though I knew very well that way leads to way. so uh, from here suppose he is taking this uh, road and and from this road you will uh, see there will be another road and this will uh, take, take to another road and in this uh, way the way will be leading to way and he knew it very well that he cannot he can he cannot treat back or he cannot come back he cannot walk back walk back to the, the to the, the position from where he made the choice and therefore therefore there is sense of loss sense of regret sense of remorse sense of sadness that that covers the mind and goes to the mind of the, the poet he knew it very well he doubted very well that that way leads to ways and it is not possible for him basically to, to come back to the particular point from where he made the choice choice in his life Is it clear, my dear children? Now let us uh, come to the last danger. I shall be telling this with a sigh. Somewhere ages and ages hence, two road divers in a wood and I took the the road one less travelled by, and that has made all the difference. Now see. We are in the, the last stage of the, the poem. The poet was uh, telling that it is a uh, very regretful. Sai ka matlab kya hai? S I G S. Sai ka matlab hai absos. Sai ka matlab hai regret. R E G R E T. Regret. 
so why why there is a regret regret means there is a sense of loss there is a sense of loss so he was a, he was at a loss he was a regretful unka man mein bahut afsos tha aur ye afsos har aadmi ko wo bolenge kya bolenge ki when i was making making the travel or when i was traveling then i found in a particular point that the route diverged and i choose the route that was a less travel by because because i thought that that road will be special and because of this special road chosen by me i am what i am today means the choice in life is very important and choice makes the person what he is today and the writer writer actually is very much regretful he is a he is a single person he actually wanted to take another route also but he cannot take the route he knows it very well and therefore he expresses his sadness in this poem telling that he could not take the other route he knew very well that it is not physically possible to come back and treat back and take the other route and because of this choice the special choice that is taken by him his life is different from other therefore my dear children choice is very important in life and in this poem robert frost talks about the choice that is made in made in life that makes all the difference that makes what a person is therefore therefore we'll have to remember this poem and accordingly we'll make the choice in our life so that in future we do not repent or regret and make our life very bright or shining with this let me conclude thanks to all